This is CPM Pre-Calculus Chapter 1, number 132. So a wheel, is, a wheel is spinning at 500 revolutions per minute. Okay, so a wheel, we have a wheel, um, like a wheel here, and it's spinning at 500 revolutions per minute. So that means every minute it goes around in a complete circle 500 times. So a revolution is just going in a circle. Okay, remember one revolution equals 2 pi radians. Okay, we know that going around the whole circle is 2 pi radians. How many radians per second is that? Okay, so we want to know radians per second and we're given revolutions per minute. So we're given 500 revolutions per one minute. How do we get radians per second? Well, we can convert we know basically to cancel out minutes, we know one minute equals how many seconds? One minute, one minute equals 60 seconds. So if we multiply by this, we're going to cancel out the minutes and get revolutions per second. But how many radians per second in that is that? So how many revolutions and radians, what's that conversion? So we have one revolution equals two pi radians. So one revolution equals 2 pi radians. Okay, so these are equal. So if we multiply these across, this cancels out as well, right? And so we're left with 500 times 2 pi. Well, 500 times 1 times 2 pi. 500 times 1 times 2 pi. And our units on in the numerator are radians. And in the denominator, we have 1 times 60 times 1 and our units are seconds, okay? So they say give the exact value. That means don't put this in your calculator and approximate it, but just give the exact value. So we want the equal sign. Well, 500 times two is 1,000. 500 times one times two is 1,000 pi over 60, okay? And that's radians per second, right? And we can simplify this if we, we could have simplified the numerator and denominator. If we divide both by 2, we would get 1 left and 30 left down here, right? So we get 500 pi over 30 radians per second. Okay, and how can we simplify this? Well, we could divide the numerator and the denominator by 10. So we get 50 pi over 3 radians per second, okay? And this is the exact value. We're not going to approximate this. And this is how many radians per second this wheel is spinning. So every second, it's spinning 500 pi divided by three radians, every second. Okay, so this is the answer here. And this ends CPM Precalculus chapter one, number 132.